I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for the Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. Please remain standing for a moment of silence. From the Studio of Dreams at Tour Nation Productions. Reporting from the Studio of Dreams located at the Tour Nation Productions Complex at Ball High School in Galveston, Texas. Welcome to the award-winning Good Morning Ball High. I am Logan Martis. To get things started, as always, stay tuned for today's Time Rewind, courtesy of our good friend, David Mendel. Hello, darling. It's Time Rewind for February 23rd. In 1997, scientists in Scotland announced the first successful cloning of an adult mammal. It's a sheep named Dolly with a genetic makeup identical to her mother's. This sparks global speculation about the possibility of human cloning. President Bill Clinton weighs in. Each human life is unique, born of a miracle that reaches beyond laboratory science. I believe we must respect this profound gift and resist the temptation to replicate ourselves. Rewind to 1954 when elementary school students in Pittsburgh received the first injections of the new polio vaccine developed by Dr. Jonas Salk. Not a single child who completed the Salk vaccinations died of paralytic polio. Whitney Houston dominates the airwaves in 1991 with her ninth number one single in five years. That's Time Rewind. I'm David Mendel. Strand District celebrating the first weekend of Mardi Gras. On Friday we had the Umbrella Brigade and then on Saturday we had some small parades like the Jeep Parade and the Golf Cart Parade. We finished it off with Crew Babu with some great performances from the Tornettes and the band. And today's Sunday, so Fiesta Gras. We had the first parade just come by. We saw the Hispanic Dance Team. Good job guys and I hope everyone's having a great time today. In celebration of Black History Month, Mr. Hendon has made these amazing shirts that are for purchase at the tour store for $10. Celebrate and love black culture. If you're in an AP class that began second semester and are interested in taking an AP test in May of 2022, the deadline to register is March 7th, 2022. Go to www.gballtesting.com to complete one step of the registration process. Students also need to be registered for the course through My AP on the College Board website. If you are in a year-long AP class and would like to sign up, you still can, but there is a late fee associated with the exam. Please contact Felicia Becknell at feliciabecknell at gise.org for questions. Here are a couple of reminders about expectations. Dress code is being completely enforced. Electronics, no headphones from 7 to 310. Phones are permitted in the hallways during class change and in the cafeteria. ID should be worn at all times. Tardies, students' tardy class must get the tardy pass from the commons area to enter a class late. And students must have a pass in order to be in the hallways during class. The 10-10 rule must be followed. If you are in an AP class that began second semester and are interested in taking an AP test in May of 2022, the deadline to register is March 7, 2022. Go to www.gballtesting.com to complete one step of the registration process. Students also need to be registered for the course through My AP on the College Board website. If you are in a year-long AP class and would like to sign up, you still can, but there is a late fee associated with the exam. Please contact Felicia Becknell at feliciabecknell at gise.org for questions. Here are a couple of reminders about expectations. Dress code is being completely enforced. Electronics, no headphones from 7 to 310. Phones are permitted in the hallways during class change and in the cafeteria. ID should be worn at all times. Tardies. Students tardy to class must get a tardy pass from the commons area to enter a class late. And students must have a pass in order to be in the hallways during class. The 1010 rule must be followed. Lost and Found is located in room 1001A, Mrs. Rekhoff's office, who is Mr. Pillar's secretary. If you have lost something, please check in with Mrs. Rekhoff. She might have it. Attention class of 2022. Project Graduation is now selling tour cards. $10 each for amazing discounts to local businesses. Go through May 31st, 2022. And Project Graduation has gone live with the Project Grad Raffle Ticketing website. Get ready to buy those tickets. You can win up to a $5,000 Visa gift card. Spread the word. If you'd like your club, sports, or other activities, news, and announcements featured on Good Morning Ball High, email your request to Mr. Dudas. Here is today's official Good Morning Ball High picture of the day. 
If you have an interesting photo that you would like to be considered as a future picture of the day, send it to Mr. Dudas. We will be happy to feature it. Now, let's check out the official Good Morning Ball High weather forecast. Galveston weather. Set furnishing for Good Morning Ball High provided by Star Fine Furniture. Don't forget that Time Rewind can also be found on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Check it out for more pop culture and trivia. I'm Logan, wishing you a terrific day. Morning Ball High is produced by the students in the Media Arts Small Learning Community at Ball High School in Galveston, Texas. 